I'm Jean Dismay. I'm a community activist. Um, I'm one of the people who started the Third Thursday Street Festivals in Romantic. And probably about 10 years ago now, a few people got together, and, and in fact, Len Kermerman, who's probably involved in this project as a cooperative person, and some others got together and we thought, what can we, what industries could come out of Third Thursday? What industries need to happen in this community? And we realized um, well, there were a lot of artisans. And we realized that there were a lot of people in this community who wanted to bake and couldn't do it because of the health care laws. And they couldn't come to Third Thursday and sell cookies, for example. Um, so we were able to start the Swift Watery Artisans Co-op out of that because that was easy. It doesn't take a lot to do a storefront. To do a kitchen is a huge project. But even back then, we knew that's what this community needed. There were so many people who wanted to produce food and didn't have the means to do it. So I am so thrilled that after all these years of hard work that I didn't have to do, <laughs> people got together and finally this community is getting a commercial kitchen because I just have seen that need for so long. And then I'm also really aware of all the new young farmers that are starting out. I mean, we're setting records as, in terms of the whole country of more and more young farmers right here in Connecticut and Eastern Connecticut than anywhere else in the country. Farmers aren't making a lot of money on their produce, we all know that. And traditionally farmers, what do you do in the winter? Well, they sit around the fire and whittle. <laughs> Wouldn't it be great if they were making their produce and turning it into things that they could sell all year round? And they're starting to do that, and we see the farmers markets becoming annual instead of seasonal, and this is going to be a big part of that. So I'm just thrilled to death that Click is making this happen, and this is such a great opportunity for all of Eastern Connecticut, and who knows, maybe we'll be exporting nationally. This is economic development. That's the hardest thing to do. Bravo, click.